Rockefeller Center is a year round, round the clock destination, and recently some great spots have opened here to grab a bite to eat or a drink after work. First up, we're headed to Lodi. Maxime, it is so great to finally be here at Lodi. What's the vibe here? You guys kind of have a daytime, nighttime. It's a little different. Yeah, we're super happy to be here as well. Happy to have you. You can create a little bit of your own adventure here. During lunch, we offer um, a lot of kind of regionally special dishes to Italy. It's great for kind of share plates. People pop in for espresso, a pastry during the day. And then at dinner, we kind of have a nice more relaxed vibe with bigger plates meant again to be shared but at night you can make reservations for two different experiences counters and the terrazza yes yeah, so you can have the same experience either way but perhaps if you're at the counter something a little bit more fun and festive so you brought out a bunch of your signature dishes yes a pasta with sage and butter our chicken liver crostini that is like heaven in the mouth the veal milanese. We also have uh, anchovies with marinated peppers and butter. A skill that's required to work for New York Live is double fisting cocktails. Okay. I'm a pro. On our right here, we have our signature Rockefeller martini, uh, La Specialina, and our rose frappe. Is it true that this will be on tap this summer? It will be on tap at our outdoor bar. Maxime, thank you for this delicious evening. I will be back. You're very welcome. We'll be here. Up next, we are at Pebble Bar on 49th Street and 6th Avenue. Julian, congratulations, Pebble Bar finally open here at Rock Center. Tell me all about it. It's been a while in the making. Yeah, uh, pre-pandemic, we signed the lease, thought we had a clear path that was slightly uh, deviated from due to the global pandemic, but um, five weeks ago, we finally got the doors open. And this space has some history. Can you tell me about it? Yeah, until 2000, it had been a bar for about 100 years called Hurley's that had hosted uh, Johnny Carson and his crew. They SNL, eras of the SNL community, um, NBC, the folks from Christie's across the street. So what do we have here in front of us? We've got East Coast oysters, West Coast oysters, shrimp cocktail, a whole lobster, Jonah crab salad, lobster roll. So cocktail is obviously a big part of Pablo Bar. What did you bring out? We've got our uh, riff on a gin and tonic, the Ginny Fallon for one of our uh, favorite neighbors. We've got the Studio 1H Martini, my version's with gin, but lots of people go for vodka too. Uh, and we've got the Wallflower Cocktail, which is a uh, mezcal based, um, refreshing, lighter, minty lemony cocktail. I am not one, but I'll drink it. <laughs> well, Julian, congratulations on Pebble Bar. It's awesome, and we're super happy to have it here. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Chin chin.